Radio was cracking, guys. You read that title correctly. I am so excited. Angela on The Maury Show. I've never seen The Maury Show. I've also never seen any of the shows we talk about. Why? Because they're trash. They post clips on YouTube for a reason. The whole hour show's boring as fuck, probably. They titled it, 90 Day Fiance Star Exposes Cheating Daughter. I heard her daughter's a pedophile. Nice. Also, if you guys see any watches in the back that you like, this green one is sold. Man, that would go good with my outfit right now. It's okay, I'm rocking a bull of a Macchino right now. This shit's super dope. That green chronograph hand and the chronograph pushes are green? Get the fuck out of here. I added some green strap bands, too, to make a match. It's beautiful. I think this color green is, like, my favorite color. Isn't that funny? Okay, sorry, I'm just trying to be relatable. Let's talk shit about human beings together. This has to be good. Everyone, welcome Scotty and her boyfriend, Terry, to the Mari Show. You see... I hate when crowds fake cheer. You know they put up a sign that flashes that says cheer. If I was in the audience, I'd be like this. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Is my husband the father of my sister's daughter? Nice. Wow, this show sounds incredible. Two months ago, they welcomed their first daughter, Anna Skye. But apparently not everybody is celebrating this birth. You see... I would have been like, woo! Get a late abortion. You can get abortions up until they're 18 years old, right? Scotty's mother, Angie, claims Terry is not baby Anna Sky's father. Woof. Angela looks like if the moon was a person. From the jump, I don't believe this. This bitch wants to be on reality TV so bad. Because think of, like, yourself and your family. Would they really be willing to do this on television? This is more of a sit down and talk type of thing. But I'm here for it. In fact, Angie, her mother, says that Scotty's ex-boyfriend, Chris, is the real father. I uh, know, I feel like we'd find that out pretty quick. Wow, this kid's getting dark, huh? What's, that? What's going on with that? Take a look at Angie's shocking accusations. I'm here to prove today that my daughter's boyfriend, Terry... Oh my God, she's the same person. People don't change. The fact that she was on Maury and 90 Day Fiance. What's going on here, TLC? Statistically, unlikely. They're picking people who are already on TV because you could do all of this without cameras. Is not the father of my grandbaby, Anna Sky, But I know who is her ex-boyfriend, Chris. I know Scotty had a one-night stand with Chris two weeks before she got with Terry. Hate that you know that about your daughter. This is a crazy thing to say about your daughter. Huh, who raised her? Maybe she was just taking after her gutter bitch of a mom. Angela was pissed on the last episode at her husband for talking to hotter women on Instagram when she was talking to another guy. He stayed the night at our house and I heard him through the walls having sex. Ooh, ah, uh, ooh. What the fuck? Wear some earplugs. Why are you listening to your daughter having sex? Leave the house. What do you do, fucking bang on the wall? She didn't come yet. Then I walked in on him and Chris is standing there, butt ass Nick. Two weeks later, I, Scotty went around telling me she thought she was pregnant. How can Terry be the father? I love this fucking energy for this show. Like, screaming. Even though that's who she is. Just because you heard her moaning and walked into him butt naked doesn't mean they were fucking. What if they were... Moving furniture, and it got hot in there. Use your noggin. How could Terry be the father? Well, he also could have fucked your daughter. Sounds like everybody has. I don't think this is the one where we find out she's a pedophile, because that would be quite a bit to handle in one six-minute clip. To me, that baby's black. That being said, Chris is mixed. <laughs> to me, that baby's black. Okay, well, let's find out first, because you're making it sound like it's a pejorative. This situation is driving me crazy. And these video pans of the people who are on the show just looking serious, like... Also, really quick, it just made me pop in my mind. Is the movie Zoolander, is that the one with the models? I don't really watch movies, but is that... Dude, I want them to make a new one, and I want to be in it. I could do the face. Watch. <laughs> DNA results so the truth can finally come out. 
I can't wait to ruin my daughter's life and ruin every trust she has with the man going forward. Hong Kong, anybody need their dick sucked for a fiver? Your mother said that you and your ex, Chris, Thank she you. heard you. She, if she heard anyone, it was me and him. She ain't heard us do nothing. He's here for his 15 minute of fame. You hear me? Who? He the Chris. Chris. He knows he ain't the daddy. But if he was the daddy, he'd take care of the first one. He didn't do nothing for the first. <laughs> Wait, you already have a kid with this guy? And your argument that you didn't fuck this guy and that it's not his kid is that he's not around like he was for the first one? No, I'm thinking it's his kid. And your mom said she saw him naked. Do these guys look similar naked? Let's see. Listen, uh, whoa, dude, calm down a little bit, Chris. I don't know why I'm remembering their names. This dude's getting angry. He probably has a clenched fist like Arthur. He sent $20 the first look time. Look at him. And Liz took it. 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 Took Answer this question. I'm ready to go. Around the time you got pregnant, were you with Chris? No, I wasn't. Two You're months apart. You're a damn lie. Two months. Two months. He wants his... He, look, he's just doing this to cause friction here. Really? He knows he ain't the daddy more. They know he's not the daddy. Listen, he ain't done nothing well, for the why first you, one. Why is your mother... Oh, God. He didn't do anything for the first kid that is his, so he wouldn't fuck me again. I don't know. You're taking care of the first one. And you got a whole man who's just willing to take care of other guys' kids? You're checking all the boxes. Turning against this you. One was, Why is your mother turning? Because she's just thinking, she's delusional. I don't know. Ask her more. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I'm going to ask question her. question as good as mine. I don't know. Can I go? Can I go? Like it's a water slide. My turn yet? This is fucking disgusting behavior. You know, I did find out recently that I think 60% of people can't even read at a sixth grade level. So maybe this is real. I, I always try and have to remind myself that. Like, they probably think it out like, yeah, I'll throw my daughter on the bus. I'll be on TV. I'll be a star. The only thing she has close to a star is her weight. She said, she said she walked in on you and Chris. If you walked in on anybody else two months prior. You fucked this dude two months prior? Oh, boy. Imagine sitting next to your woman. No, I didn't fuck him then. It was two months before that. And you just got to back her up because she's pegging you after this. She says you got, you got pregnant too quickly when you started going oh, out with Oh, now she can tell me when I ovulate? <laughs> okay. okay. Who, who do you think the baby looks like? Come on, Is this not crazy to anybody else? <laughs> Throw in this picture up. Whose baby does it look like? Could you do this in 2023? Uh, the guy on the left. That's who it looks like. But to be fair, I've also never seen a fresh half black baby. And apparently Chris is mixed. So I am just being an asshole. It is within the realm of possibilities that it is his child. Especially because this girl is a whore. <laughs> Who's the baby look like? What you no, no, is no. that baby mixed? No! That's no. white. It's white, right? Yeah. Hell yeah, white bower. <laughs> Yeah, go fuck yourself, dude. I fucking love this show. I had a visceral feeling watching them boo her. Oh my god, I'm gonna watch that again. Chris, I didn't know Terry before. Chris come over why, one night. Why, He's why, the baby. Why, why you... Listen, Maury, chill out. <laughs> oh my god, this bitch really thinks she's the main character and she's built like a fat bag of laundry. Like, if garbage bags could smoke cigarettes and get diabetes. Even he's like, Jesus Christ, I might smack this bitch. I guarantee you he actually had the thought of, she needs her own show. Wow, we really struck gold with this one. This is like watching a Marvel movie crossover. This is fascinating. I want to tell you something. I do a show. I chill out a lot, okay? I know, I know. Yeah, boy, I'm not sitting out to miss enough. Okay, I'm fine. I'm not against my okay. daughter. Yes. And I'm not 
against her. You're Tell not, you're you're not against your daughter? Vendor. You're on international television saying that she cheated on her man with some guy and is lying about who the father of the kid is. Now you're talking her up, making her look really good, actually. Because that's what a guy wants, to worry if his kid is his. Because if it's not his kid, he's like, that's just a fucking money pit. You, let me tell you, let me explain. Why don't you just believe because your daughter? I was there two okay. weeks before Terry was going with Scotty. It was two months. Chris, Mama, you two lost day, it. You're lying. I caught her screwing Let's Chris. Bring it down. Wow, Angela's ugly. <laughs> also, I'm kind of on the daughter's side. Angela, I could totally see her being like, two weeks, two months, same shit. Same difference, bitch. I'm the mom. I saw what I seen. What are my guesses? Okay. I don't know, dude. It's really a coin toss. Because I feel like it's all fake, but... Oh, wait. The title says exposes cheating daughter. I really don't watch these before I talk shit about them. I'm trying to... I mean, I really want the kid not to be his. You know, I want it to be the black guy's kid. You know, it's actually easier for both of us if I just refer to the guys by their skin color. Because Chris could be either of them. Terry, that's a woman's name. <laughs> Well, who's this? I never said. Lori. Shut your mouth. I Jesus Christ. This is the most angry TED talk I've ever seen. This is impressive with how comfortable she is acting this way in front of a crowd. Like, that's a packed audience. It's probably, on the big end, 150 people. That's a little scary. I guess it's a little scarier when you have to go be funny in front of 150 people. It's probably pretty easy just to scream and be a piece of shit. They are booing her, actually, and she's... Oddly comfortable with it. You know, I probably would be too, but then I'd have a real Bill Burr Philadelphia moment. Anywhere. What the fuck? <laughs> Why'd you have to do that act out? Why are you doing all this? I don't know when this came out, but man, she had to wait so long to be on TV again. She probably thought she made it big. This is before Instagram, right? So this is like MySpace times? Was this before MySpace? I don't know. I'm 28, if that helps. But she's really eating this up, fucking putting her hands in the air. Thank you! You got a cigarette? You got a lighter as well? I forgot mine in my other bra. Now you can have a seat. Here's the ex-boyfriend, Chris! Whoa, 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 whoa. Why are y'all booing this guy? What did he do? He did abandon his first kid. Well, you know, it's your first kid. Kids are like motorcycles, right? You don't keep your first one. Not because you ride them, because you get rid of them quickly. Unless you're Angela's daughter. She's a pedophile. Bring that up. Are they going to be yelling about that? Well, they're definitely not going to talk about it. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Dumbass. Well, this dude's dressed like he's ready for a court date. And he's still the best dressed one there. Only one who seems like they give a shit. Why would she not fuck this guy over Terry? His name's Terry. He's a cuck. Are they not going to have a conversation about how she fucked this guy two months before him? It's kind of important. You know what's also important? Look at this new knife I got. So beautiful. That wood handle. Wow. You know this ain't your baby. You want your 15 minutes? I don't know. I don't know. If he ain't my baby, today. then why'd it's you come to me telling me that it's you were trying to pull you down? His ass. Hey. Let the new guy fucking talk. He's been in the back. God, I really hate when multiple people yell into audio at the same time. Because it's the same audio source. They're using one audio track. They're not making somebody louder and somebody quieter. They're just both fucking loud at the same time. Everybody sit down. I'm taking my show back right now. Yeah, fuck that bitch, dude. I don't know if I like more yet, like him as a person. Let's see. I did see like a YouTube short of him cracking a bottle of Hennessy. I'm like, it's not that cool. For some reason, it just kept showing me that video. Like as if I gave a shit. Like as if an old white dude drinking Henny is unique. Well, you guys don't like Maury anymore? Well, what if he sips Hennessy? You know what would have been impressive? If he just poured up some activist. He's just like, yeah, called this Lil Act. The numbers would skyrocket. Also, that is like such a niche joke. But if you listen to rap heavily, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, Chris. Bye -bye. 
Chris. Yes, sir. Could you be the father of this child? It is a possibility because me and Scotty slept together while she was still sleeping with him while I was that's staying alive. And school. you know that's a lie. I was getting you know that's a lie. It's not a very confident answer. Could this be your child? It's a possibility. A possibility. Oh, we're, well, we're on TV. Say yes definitively, asshole. Like, we don't need him on the fence. Why is she insisting that Terry's the father? Because Scotty, in her mind, she cannot be wrong. Especially when you're right. Yeah, okay, well, that's I'm getting angry. Stop doing this. They don't like you. Also, look at how many people are there. Imagine acting this way in the room full of people the size of my graduating class. High school, not college. I didn't graduate college. Obviously. Okay, in that moment, I would have stood up as well. That's when I would have got into it. I know that this isn't a possibility, but I'm just really hoping it's just some random third guy. It's Maury. <laughs> when it comes to Anna Sky. Anna. Anna Sky. I like Thank that. You. Anna Sky. Is this what everybody's first Maury experience is like? I'm so excited right now. You only get to experience this one time. Chris. You are not ah! the father. When it comes to two-month-old Anna Sky. My racism was correct. This is kind of like watching a superhero movie and they always win at the end. In hindsight, now I kind of found out that I wish it was Chris's kid. But it's cool to know Angela's wrong, as always. How's the relationship with your daughter now? Bet you she doesn't call you mom. But what really put me off was how excited Terry got. Hey, buddy. You still lost. And also, as if Chris didn't take home a huge W, as if he wasn't like, whoo, somehow dodged the first one and I dodged the second. This is great. I'm never wearing a condom again. Terry, you are the father. <laughs> yeah, right when your kid grows up to the age of 18, I'm gonna send him this clip. And I think that's coming up soon. I'd love to hear their thoughts on it. Hey, look at how excited your dad is about being your father. That's how unsure he was. Acting like he just won a bet with his life savings on DraftKings. You know what? Honestly, this dude probably did bet on this. I don't know, man. You're still a cuck. Yeah, it's your kid. But this dude... Piped her recently. Kid's two months old. Like, I'm trying to think, like, are they still gonna argue in the car? Or are they just like, yeah, we did it, go us. Like as if this is in any way a good situation. To get bad news for you. If you have to do a DNA test for your kid, you're in the wrong relationship. But what do I know? That was my first Maury experience. Not bad. So there's another one. Was she also on Maury about how her daughter's a pedophile? I need to see that. We'll do that one tomorrow if it exists. But comment down below what you guys think. This was fascinating, seeing her be a piece of shit in a different location, as if I'm shocked. They didn't show Angela after that at all. She's like, disappeared. I wanna see her face when she's wrong, cause that's gonna build some resentment between your daughter and you. This isn't gonna end well. She's not gonna go to your funeral, which is soon, Angela. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching and listening everywhere. I appreciate every single one of you. Yo, did you know that I do stand-up comedy and post every single set on my second channel, youtube.com slash Markarski? It shows, like, every single set from the beginning, first open mic, up to me doing the first sold-out show, and then now still just, like, working on bits. I'm posting them every Saturday. It used to be three days a week. But I'm going to burn myself out. That would be eight videos a week plus doing stand-up every night. No, thank you. So the last video that came out was me doing stand-up in March, so there's a big backlog. I'll try and like wake up earlier and edit some more and hopefully be able to get back to the three times a week. But it's more for documentation purposes because I think 10 years from now, it's going to be really cool for people to look back and see like how it all began and how it all kind of formed into what it was. Because when I would watch Tom Segura, I was always like, man, it'd be super cool to see how he started. So I don't think anybody's ever documented an entire stand-up career before. And I think people might be interested like what goes on behind the scenes of stand-up comedy. So if you want to see some shit like that, youtube.com slash Markarski. But if you can't or don't want to, I totally understand. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Let's keep that algorithm going, baby. I fucking love you guys. Mwah.